In this tutorial, I will show you how to set up a Django 1.7 project on Linux Mint using PostgreSQL and Python 3.4. So first, if you do not already have Python pip installed, please install that now. Now, using Python pip, install virtual environment. In order to get Django to work with PostgreSQL, we also need to install a couple of dependencies. Install Python 3 dev and libpq dev. Now we can begin setting up our projects. Make a directory called Django and cd into that directory. Here we will set up our virtual environment. We want to use Python 3.4, so we will set the dash p option and point it to the Python 3.4 bin. Now if we list the contents of the Django folder, we will see a vnv folder. This is where Virtual Environment will install all of our packages and dependencies for this project. So to do so, we need to start our project with source vnv bin activate. And as you can see, we are now running the virtual environment. Now we can install packages using pip, and they will belong only to this project and not to the entire system. So let's begin by first installing Django. To use PostgreSQL, we need to install one more package. Now we can use Django to start a new project. Now if we list the contents of our Django folder, we see the new project folder. By default, Django uses SQLite to implement its database. However, we want to use PostgreSQL for this project. So first, we need to install PostgreSQL. Once you have installed PostgreSQL, we need to switch to the newly created Postgres user to create a database user and a database. We will first create a new Postgres user. Be sure to use the interactive and password prompt flags. Give your user a unique name.
and a password. We do not want the database user to be super user, so answer no. We do, however, want the user to be allowed to create databases, so answer yes. We do not need the user to be able to create new roles, so answer no. Now we need to create a PostgreSQL database. We can do this with the createDB command. Using PostgreSQL, we need to also grant privileges on the database to our new user. So enter PSQL, and at the prompt, enter grant all privileges on database, your database name, to your username, such as We have successfully set up a database user and database to use with our Django project. So enter slash Q to exit PostgreSQL. And enter exit to return to your standard user. Now we need to update the settings file in our new project with the information that we just entered. So open the settings file of your project. And scroll down to the databases section. Change the engine from django.db.backends.sqlite3 to django.db.backends.postgresql underscore Change the name to your database name and add a user, password, host, and port field. Be sure to set host to localhost and port to nothing. Now save your changes and return to the command line. CD into your new project folder. Before we can begin, we need to tell Django to set up the database tables. To do this, we use the make migrations command. So enter Python manage.py make migrations. Now enter python manage.py migrate. Your Django project is now installed, but before we can view it, we need to run the server. So enter python manage.py run server. This will show you the URL at which your project can be seen. And there it is. Now you know how to install Django 1.7 using Python 3 and PostgreSQL. If you enjoyed this tutorial, please subscribe to our YouTube channel or visit us on www.dotdotdot.com. Thank you for watching.